In this fourth BIM tutorial movie, you will learn how to place the first floor exterior walls, floor slab and terraces. Continue working in your own model or download the step 3 drawing. Dimensions can be found in Dimensions PDF. All dimensions are in millimeters. Make clear exterior walls 1 current. Set the elevation to 2750 and set Ignore Entity Snap Elevation on. Start the Polysolid command and snap to the top corner of the rear ground floor wall. Move the cursor to the right, parallel to the x-axis and hit the Shift key to lock the polar tracking line. Then snap to the top corner of the front ground floor wall twice. Snap to the bottom left corner of the front wall. Choose the Close option to create the last exterior wall. Type the height, then hit the Tab key and type the width. Before accepting the dimensions, repeatedly hit the Control key to set the justification of the walls to left. Repeat the polysolid command to create two more walls. Dimensions and alignment of the previous walls are reused. Isolate the exterior walls one layer using the Lay ISO command. Adjust this L connection. Hit the control key until the desired connection displays. Use push-pull to lengthen the wall. Start a rectangle command, hover over the side face of the wall and hit the shift key when it highlights. The dynamic UCS is now locked and use the extrude command to split the wall in two. Now use push-pull to adjust the opening. Hit the tab key to select an obscured face. Use the Lay Uniso command to display all layers. Make layer floor slab 1 current and freeze layer exterior walls 1. Draw two rectangles to create the first floor slab. Unify both slabs. Isolate the slab. We will now select all side faces of the slab using Window Select. Hit the Control key once to select the side faces which are inside the selection window. To prevent the top and bottom face to be selected, a two-step procedure is needed. Use push-pull to move all side faces 200 mm inwards. Display all geometry.
Select all first floor exterior walls Then choose Subtract in the quad and subtract the first floor slab. Isolate the slab. Draw three rectangles which define the outline of the terraces. Select the rectangles and extrude the terrace solids. Unify the two terrace slabs at the front. Display all geometry. Isolate the first wall exterior walls and the terrace slabs. Use push-pull to adjust the dimensions of the terrace slabs. Hit the tab key to select the reference face. This wall needs to be extended to the edge of the rear terrace. Subtract the terrace slabs from the first floor exterior walls. Add a wall at the edge of the rear terrace. Create 100 by 100 edges on the terrace slabs. Unify the edges and the terraces. Display all geometry. Set boundary detection on and use extrude to create the opening for the patio in the first floor slab. Thank you for watching and enjoy working with BricsCAD. Download the free trial version of BricsCAD at www.brixis.com and check it out for yourself.